Okay, sup guys, this is OU Secret Finals. Uh, Poke TG Gamer was is finding true love, and I think they're good friends. And what is this disgusting Sailor Rain stall? Oh, it's like no, it's not stall. It's like Rain Balance. <laughs> but yeah, Porsche is gonna play soon versus Steve Angelo. So I'm not sure if I'm gonna be able to record this game. Like I wanna record the Porsche game a bit more than Actually, this one. Can, can you send me the, the link to the battle? I oh. I, I still cannot cannot access to small tools for some reason. Yeah, sure. Yeah, yeah, I know. He he just added me. At okay, so it's uh, get the free substitute. So the teacher is gonna put in some work because mm -hmm. the save like, I mean save like was it pretty much in the rain, but you can still fish for earth pass with death drops. So there's some bulky um, offense. Pokotishi Gamer is in um, losers, like he won the losers thing. And Finding True Love was still in winner's bracket. So um, he only has to win one best of three. And uh, Rob, aka Pokotishi G, would have to win two best of threes to win uh, OU Circuit. Yeah, I haven't uploaded any games so far, even though I recorded, I think, two rounds of Rob. Uh, of Rob's series. One time there was like <laughs> interruption all the time. Like, it was annoying as fuck because kick as I kept disconnecting and he eventually lost to disconnect, so I didn't want to upload that. <laughs> it's gonna. Is he Will O Wisp? Okay, just off pause. Okay, that might have been a roll. And Porsche said, Why are there no 500 users? I really like Pookie TCG Gamer's team. The, his opponent's team, on the other hand, is pretty disgusting. <laughs> yeah. Dennis doesn't like rain. Dennis doesn't like um, Sable. No, I mean, it's not that I don't no, like I'm rain. I'm just saying you don't rain like is, Sable. Yeah. It's just annoying to face rain. Yeah, Sable is. Yeah, is the combination of rain and Sable is what yeah, you don't yeah. like. Nah, so Sable, I. You, nah. Yeah, rain plus sableye has to be the most annoying thing to face. Yeah, so if he has leaf storm, he can try to uh, force the sableye to go for recover, and then like get a free switch into something. He can also go hard heat turn, but he, he goes Landris predicting the knockoff because it's probably Z move Landris. Mhm. Mm Good play. Yeah. And he scares out the sableye with the Z move predicts the Ferrothorn and gets the play wrong. Mm -hmm. Did he predict that? I don't, I don't, I don't know. Staying in to du to double knockoff is a bit weird. So maybe I mean, it was risky, double. but I think he, yeah. he maybe he knows how he plays because they are friends. Mhm. Mm like <laughs> he definitely. Yeah, like, he he had to have predicted a, a, some sort of double to double knockoff like, like that. The other Mola was or uh, Ferrothorn was pretty obvious. So um, oh, he gets a burn. This is looking bad for Rob already. He gets a volt switch here, Bob. Pharaoh on the volt switch. So he can go he turn pincer. Well the, the team is pretty is pretty disgusting looking, but he's playing very well. Yeah, yeah he's, he's really good. He like he went he won two and oh versus um I forgot who he played last round. I, I don't know if it was Kick Essa or C Jumas. It was some I think it was some French. Yeah, player. you 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 told me he beat Kick Essa. Yeah, I think it was two and oh. Which is like crazy. This guy has gold at the moment. Ice beam. Damn. I mean, this is all with Tango, so... Oh, gets a crit. Like, Heatran losing the leftovers is so bad for Rob. Yeah. So I don't think he can win that. Like, this is just looking Oh bad. my god. He was not even yeah, spex. No, no. He's live up. I didn't realize I that. Yeah, me neither. Obviously I don't think he's. I don't know. Maybe it's it's too soon to. I mean, he can go. I'm, to spoke, I'm speaking too soon, but like he's he's in a, such a bad position already. Yeah, he can go Tangrowth here, or um, I don't really see the other play besides Tangrowth. Did you see what Porsche said in the chat? 
<laughs> yeah, so Steve Angelo's a bit late, so hopefully we can recall at least the first best of three. And I mean, if Finding True Love just goes two and oh, the series is over. But I hope yeah. that Rob can win a game. But on the other hand, I don't want to miss the partial game. So not sure <laughs> how many games I want to see here. I mean, what can Tangros can even kill the King Draw? I can either go for Knockoff or Leaf Storm. Unless he's um, a hacker and he goes for sleep powder with a soul with Tangros. <laughs> <laughs> but he's not. Oh, he's gonna pivot and he turn on the ice. That's a good play. Yeah. Just uh, to so he's gonna live up stall life basically. Li yeah, live for live for from stall and stall mean, out some ring turns. I guess. You think he's gonna Draco here, bringing the Ladi? I mean, I mean, pump, he... pump is fine. Like, I don't yeah, pump is. As long as it hits, like, yeah. He went for item pump. <laughs> so, so maybe, Poker G Gamer is trying he's... to get him to overpredict. Yeah, in... Okay, nice play. Yeah. Like he's getting every play correct. He goes Feral on the lead yeah. storm as if he knew that he wouldn't go for a knockoff. Wait, Alex was his banners on Tuesday. Get me out of here, dude. I stayed up <laughs> for this game. I didn't sleep, like, huh? He's I uh, got Magnus see... Storm. Because, like, not only, like, finding True Love's team is pretty bulky, but he's playing it. He's preserving the, his mounts well, too. So like... I mean, he made an early aggressive play with a double knockoff. Mm. It's, it's. That was risky. It's gonna be so... I think yeah. maybe he knows that. It's... Oh my god. Like, the U turn on Defog break in the Ladi did not attack. What a god. Um, yeah, damn. That's like. I don't know if I would have made that play, because. Do you really and need that U turn? Do you really need that U turn know. damage on the Ladi? Like, I don't know. I probably wouldn't have and made now, the U turn play. And now it goes. I mean, it back worked into, out. I guess he was confident. He was he, w he wasn't gonna attack because of a fair turn, but I mean he needs rocks of a pins there, I get it. And also Trent lost the lefty, so he needs rocks of even more. No, like, like every damage on Heatron is pretty nice. This is not gonna kill because of the rain. Rocks. Yeah, this is yeah. looking. And now Larios is dead upon entry, so oh, we can even deep up. I thought it was at sixteen, but it maybe it took no, burn damage. 10. Okay, yeah, it took burn damage then. Damn. Yeah, I think this is looking pretty bleak for Poketitus. I mean, Cavatops comes in here and yeah. can click um, Stone Edge. I assume it might be the Continental Crush Cavatops. <laughs> mm. Yeah, I mean, that will be his only Zemo user. And that's his name of Alamomola. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding. Is this called? What? Okay. So. Actually, does he need to risk? I mean, he can waterfall. Here? He doesn't have to risk yeah. the miss. Two percent. Like I don't even see any way for no. Rob to come back. I don't um, think I've ever seen Mega Sableye rain. That's a nasty tactic. No, I haven't seen that either. Man, I forgot to get wrap my thing. It's not my laptop, but I have a second laptop in this house. I should have grabbed that one. I mean, don't, don't you just suck Heatran now? It's pretty useless. Like, Ferrofern is down. Heatran is only nice to, like, um, toxic Alamomola, but he's not gonna let yeah. that... He's not gonna let that happen. Exactly. Uh, Sableye like walls Heatran, especially in rain. Like, that's kind of a cool combination, because yeah. usually um, Heatran is a bit annoying to Sableye, but in mm -hmm. rain, Magma Storm doesn't do any damage. <laughs> that's true. Yeah, Heatran is useless. It doesn't have lefties, it's pretty low. It only outspeeds um, Alamola, Sableye. Maybe the maybe it outspeeds the Pelipper, but yeah. Well, yeah, well, sucks Larios to scout. I mean, yeah, Ladi wasn't nice. doing anything, and he wasted Z move there. I don't think that was necessary. All out pummeling, but that was Z low Does kick. It... Low kick, yeah, because it doesn't get superpower, yeah. Low kick. Interesting. <laughs> What's this nastiness that boy's trying to get on YouTube? Porsche, um made a guest yeah, I mean, upload. Um, I mean, Already mentioned that's this. that's what we all think. that's what we all think. It's a pretty nasty team, but like, I mean, he gets two kills at least. But like, 
it's the score is 4-4 but this game is not really close I, yeah. finding true love was in control the entire time of here um, you can go Sableye, he can go he can go um, Pelopon U-turn I probably would have gone Pelopon U-turn but yeah. I guess I think might kill I actually don't have my calc open let me see the creep before did over 60 percent um, the calc is loaded they already made yeah he did the crit ice beam did 68 so maybe oh it's I a roll it then kills, yeah Tangrowth can't kill the Kingdra. Exactly. So Best he can do is like Leaf Storm. Maybe he will go into. And Leaf Storm doesn't, doesn't kill, I don't think. Yeah, I think he should. But if he sacks Heatran, he's actually gonna lose to Ice Beam Spam, I think. Mm, once Leaf, rain, Leaf Storm might come close to killing. Hmm. I, do, I don't know. I wanna call it one kill. second. Uh, thing. Okay, he doubles into Pelipper. Okay. Oh, just to lower the special attack, I guess. And to get up rain. Oh, get rid of the... Th I don't know, like, I probably would have gone Yeah, because now, now, now mm. that growth is at minus two, he's gonna do no damage. He, he either switches out and the heat turn or, like, stays in. And so the rain basically lets him outspeed the... Yeah, let's not speed the pincer. Uh, Leaf Storm, um, why does this calculator? The calculator only has Giga Drain, and Giga Drain is 31 to 37 from Tangrus to Kingdra, so I think my Leaf Storm wouldn't kill from this range even though at neutral. I think, I think he's, he's gonna suck Heat right now because he's not staying in basically with Tangrus, I don't think. Oh, that's Uber Premier League too, but I'm bad at Uber, so I'm not gonna try to narrate that. Because <laughs> even if even if Kingdra has life or bite speed, Tangrowth is the only thing that takes a hit. Yeah, yeah, he has to switch probably. And he knows that he has to switch, so he might Hydro Pump. Yeah, he turn. I would suck if he turn. I mean, Hydro Pump is fine, because even if he stays in, he can't really do that much damage. The best he could do is knock off the uh, life orb. But losing the life up also would mean that he get it's fine. That he doesn't take recall anymore. Yup, hydro pump back into the tank. Okay, Leafstrom definitely kills now. Yeah, should kill. Can he just go save life? Yes, at least some spadaf. He should be able to eat this up, and then just go for recall. I think so. Like it should only do like around half to save life. Yeah, exactly. We did exactly half. Mm -hmm. Nice head calc. And now what does he do? Like, um, either goes pincer or he turns. He go hard. Um, if he's, yeah, hard pincer under a cover, but I don't know. If he's sub pincer, maybe has a chance. But I, I doubt he's sub pincer. He's going for the crit. Mm. Hmm. Like, yeah. He's definitely not sub pincer, but it would've been cool to see. Yeah, if he wasn't, if he wasn't for this mega saber, this would've been, this would be a lot closer. But... Sable is actually really annoying. She has the early game on the knockoff, man. Mm -hmm. I mean, I completely understand the double knockoff play because I think he was predicting him to bait the Will O Wisp and go on Heatran. Yeah. Yeah, that was a, a great play. The double knockoff. Earth power on the king. I think he's gonna go Tangrowth, but... Wait, does... Oh, it just Draco, because Draco basically uh, does good damage to everything. It kills each one. Yeah. would do a lot to Tangrowth, would kill Pinsir. I mean, Sableye wins. Sableye plus... Yeah, Sableye wins. Not Sableye even if, it double, even if it doubles now to Pinsir, Pinsir doesn't kill, I think. Okay, he didn't. I mean, Pinsir yeah. can technically beat Sableye, but it would get burned in the process unless it dodges or has substitute, and then Alamomola wins if Pinsir gets burned. Yeah. So, yeah. This came a little bit closer than I thought it would. If he crits here? <laughs> yeah, me, me, me too, actually. Nope. So, what does he do? Does he just knock off? I mean, he still know, knew what he had to do. Like. 
He didn't really make any risky plays because he like was in control kind of. Yeah, um Saber gets a free will o wisp here. Mm -hmm. I think he's just gonna fish for crit because crit might kill with a max roll. Or high roll. Because I don't think he would want to knock off here, because if Pinsler comes in on a knockoff... Actually... Might potentially sure, kill. Are you sure a crit liftstorm kills Disabler from... I mean, it did, it did 50. 76. It did 50, mm. so crit would do 75, so maybe he said 75. Like, if he gets a high roll, it would do 76, 75. Mine like, Shodan runs down sometimes, so it says 76, mm -hmm. but he might be 75. Should uh, tell Porsche to wait longer if he starts. EQ, yeah, this, this is over. Sable like cannot be beaten at this point unless unless I'm crazy crazy. Dude, this looks like standard rain, and then he put a uh, Sable over Swampert and Alamomola over um Tornadus, yeah. something like that. I mean, crit would kill at this range, but yeah. Like the f the first row of of Pokemon legit looked like some semi stall or stall, and then Pelipper Kingdra and Kabutops. Yeah, it's like like Blunder's. I don't know if Blunder said that in his video. Oh, he's going for dodge. He can win if he mm. dodges. Okay. Nope. Like did Blunder say that in his video where it's like the the five players on Pokemon Showdown? I don't know if there's like a type type of player that has. Two months of every playstyle on his team, <laughs> but that that should be definitely a category. There's like sometimes there's like players yeah. that pair up. They have like the Volturn Core, Landris Rotom, then the next two months um, it's like two Wall Breakers, and then like I don't know two other months. I can't think. So now, now Pinsir is is at plus two basically because it went for two SDs. Um, I think I think it's only at like plus one point five because. Oh yeah, yeah, um, the burn. It has the attack, so it's basically a uh, three times the attack and then divided by two. Yeah, Alomola tanks. I mean, he has to crit or something, but if it's fifth of Alomola, huh. the thing is, if he has these again, that doesn't help him. Yeah, he has to crit. Hmm. Yeah, so yeah, Reach, yeah, SD again wouldn't have helped him because he just takes burn damage and. Yeah. Alomola can go for Skull next turn, blah blah blah, annoying. <laughs> Alomo, mo, mo, I think he's gonna have to SD here and bank on the Alomola. Yeah, it's, it's the only protect and hope for a crit or something. Wait. Wait, wait him does not, this... not go for protect. Wait, does he have a chance what? to win? Doesn't he win now? Now, does the, does the Sable have like protect or fake out? Wait, he just what? wins now. Very well played. Wait, did he actually? Yeah, he pre the, he predicted the him to on, he on predict not protecting. He predicted him to SD. That was kind of 50-50. Yeah, I was I was just about to say, watch him not go for protect, expecting the SD, but that yeah, was like, crazy. You, you saw that he made an aggressive play early, and this time it didn't work out. I mean, they yeah, know each was... they know each other, and uh, yeah, nice. I don't know. This this play was very risky. I don't I don't know. Yeah, protect. Okay, but I mean, it was kind of 50-50, but yeah, I can, I I can, now. I can understand PokéDG Gamers play. Um, how did he turn it around, man? This always happens. Like I, I don't know. This gets blown like it, away. Like it, it, it's easy. To, actually, I don't know. I don't. I don't. He doesn't. He doesn't lose his, he doesn't yo, lose yo, SD, SD, SD. Yeah. Okay, he doesn't have a reason to SD. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, if Sableye outspeeds we'll Tangrus... Oh, he got the double protect, GG. Now Sableye doesn't outspeed Tangrus, but... Does it not? Yeah. Because Tangrus runs minus speed nah. nature. Uh, Sableye has like 20 base speed. Damn. I don't know, it's easy to, to say that in... From a spectator's perspective, but that... That... Not protecting play with Alomomola was way too risky in my opinion. 
But I mean, I'm pretty sure he wins anyway now. Yeah. Yo. Um. Yeah. So Damn. basically, Dennis was right. <laughs> it's like. Yeah, like Tangro's min speed is 94 and Sable has like way less mm -hmm. speed, so even if the Tangro's wants many speed, it's still faster probably. Well, this game came way closer than I thought it would be. I mean, it didn't even come close, I also, also the... G oh, never mind, That's, yeah, yeah, never mind. For a second, I thought Rob won, I'm like, what the fuck. No, 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 he forfeited, <laughs> like... Yeah, yeah, but I, w I thought like the pins had it, but then he got the double protect. Mm. I'm, like, Wild plays, I'm, like, like, like the double knock off the not protect with Alumamola. Damn. I mean, we can like th theory through the play. So if the pins are SDs on the protect, yeah. Um, I will um go back to that turn and see how much health the pins are had. So we will exactly know. Cause like Rocky Hammers does like sixteen percent, right? Or is it fifteen? Yeah, sixteen. It's sixteen. Let me, let me see. I'll oh, just f rules. try to find the turn where the pins comes in. Pinsir was at 41. Oh, you already found it out, okay. When, so, uh, yeah, when he, when he, when he knocked out a little mola, was at 41. So if you would have SD'd and... The other mola would have gone for Scald. Um... I will calc real quick how much Scald does. Did they already start the next game? Oh, they did start. Well, we're going on to the next game then. As um, he brought Ricardo's team. I know, yeah. I know his team. So he might have changed his sets, but. So now he has to win two in a row, right? Yeah, he has to win two in a row. Mm. Yeah, see the guy said in the chat it's a 50-50. Oblivion said, yeah. why, "Why didn't you protect? See if he has D on protect." I mean, I was trying to figure out if SD on protect won him the game. Yeah. I was just, like trying to see how much burn. I Rocky personally, would have done. I personally would have a click protect because like, <laughs> I, I I always play safe in those situations, but like I can I, I can understand like not protecting as well. Mm. I like finding true low's team aside of aside of the toxic pack. Yeah, I don't know why it's there. I mean, I know why it's there because it like takes everything. Okay, so fucking hit. This is um Z move Curum. I think it has HP fire. Um Z freeze shock. Mm -hmm. Fusion bolt. I don't remember the last move. And the Mew is like Volt Switch, uh Volt Switch, Stealth Rock, Roost Will O Wisp. This is also a standard defog. Wait, so he has no scarfer. Uh scarf got jump. Bro Oh, okay, Scarfagar jump, yeah. And Volcarona's yeah, Shardy yeah. Berry, but that's just the team I have, he obviously can change the set. Okay, okay. Yeah, Assault so Vest, Mew, Tango. Mew is the rocker, yeah. I, I forgot the, about um, that process. I assume this is a Scarf Greninja. On Funny True Love's team, it doesn't have to be. Because he could also have... Wait, like, wait, he's, he's running... Zard without Hazard Charizard, Control. Charizard with no Hazard Control, Probably yeah. Probably Defog Charizard. <laughs> <laughs> like, I'm assuming it's Charizard X, because... Why would you run a Zard Y with no hazard I know, control? I know it sounds insane, but he might be Defog Zard. <laughs> and Tornado's T and Zard with no hazard control, that's really... I mean, Tornado's a regenerator, that's fine. Yeah. Nice petrol in the chat. <laughs> um... Love is gonna be like, I can't join called. You you demoted me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you think he's Ash or Protein? Let me see. I think he's Protein. I don't know. I can I can almost never tell whether from team matchup. Oh, Bad Love can only call on Pokers. Skype. So if Pokes G Gamma wins this game, we will um move over Name. to Skype after the game. Skype Perino. Mm -hmm. I mean, if it's respects Darpo's, it's really risky to stay in here. Yeah, he's probably just gonna go into Tangrowth. Tangrowth, yeah, I was about to say, doesn't he just go... But if the, if the Greninja has spikes, he's definitely clicking spikes here. <laughs> <laughs> NJP, yeah. what the fuck, where's your removal? <laughs> yeah, that's what I, that's what I, what I was wondering too. That's crazy. <laughs> Ricardo. I mean, if he'd actually... 
turns out to be default Zard, I don't know. I don't know anymore. No, it can't be there. Like, it would be... It would be new to what me. What does double region mean, Petal? That doesn't mean anything. <laughs> <laughs> what? Triple region. <laughs> we are here, yeah, triple, but that doesn't... It's the Zard. He's a default Zard in the chat. Please catch up with the meta. He's getting dot dotted. I don't know if he's battle. trolling him or. Or if he's I really default Zard. I hope Pat is trolling because. No, no, I mean, dots. I don't know if Funny Trollof is trolling because he said default Cherry Z. No, he's definitely trolling. He doesn't have removal. I mean, if he has Roost and he's not X, I can kind of understand it, but even then, I would still have one and have Bing removal. Bing Eve will be proud. Wait, but. Did they fall asleep or something? Okay, they finally. Now he was just thinking through. Turn. Yeah, so it's Ash Granger. <clears throat> so he didn't yeah, have Spikes. Spikes would have been a really cool play there if he had it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that that is a big problem. Like that. Yeah. Like Garchomp can switch in once. Like Fireblaze does so much. I think it does a little bit. Oh, so I'm over guessing half. since he since he has no other removal, the the aim of the team is Yo. like to bring oh my bring Lord. in the threats. And preserve momentum. Okay, so it is that X like you predicted. Okay, I was just thinking that right for some reason. Because <clears throat> I never really see that X, but on this team it makes obviously sense. But no hazard control. <laughs> rocks. Nice. Reveal default Zard. <clears throat> Do we just gonna vault I mean, out? Yup. So I think he breaks the Dragon Lance there potentially. It was, it was gonna be basically impossible to stop Mew from setting up the rocks, I think. And he's gonna double out. Poké GG Gamers don't double out on the Alandras slash Toxapex slash Tangos. Show me the Q room. Ah. Oh, man, like Toxapex was even a fine play there. Because yeah. Scarf Jump is so weak, it eats up Earthquake and can just regen it back. I mean. I probably would have gone Tangos. Or... The only okay, this is getting a like kill. Toxapex. Yup. Toxapex. Did he... I mean, did he feel Nice involved? play, nice play. I mean, he has to make plays now if he wants to come back. Yeah. Like, he lost the first game. Awesome play. He's gonna freeze shock here, watch. <laughs> oh my god, if he, if he actually... Did. No, I Z, mean... Z freeze shock. Uh, Sub-Zero Slammer thing. Does he do it? I mean, he can also just Ice Beam. Uh, okay, okay, that's... Yeah, I mean, it, was, yeah. it wasn't really necessary, because Tangrove is lower anyway. He, he yeah, Ice Beam is a roll well. from this range. I can't see. Okay, never mind. Oh my god. <laughs> nice main roll. But yeah, I mean, Earthquake I doesn't do anything. Yeah, Tangrove does nothing to cure him anyway. He's a it. Nice. And I can go nice. um, Greninja or Zard. Uh, probably Zard. Yeah. I don't think Greninja can even kill this because Kyurem is kind of bulky. No, Greninja can kill. Yeah, can go for Dark Boots, Flinch. Padlov would go for <laughs> Flinch here. <laughs> <laughs> go for Flinch. Get the Flinch and then get the form. Nice. <clears throat> yeah, but I mean, he still has a Tangro, so like, even if he finishes the cure him, he can still go Tangro next he turn. He doesn't have a switch into Zardex, I just realized. Yeah, yeah, no, I mean, Zardex doesn't really have switch in. So yeah, that's true. But I mean, Landros is a good check, but like, Landros gets overpowered, yeah, and this team also doesn't have a Landros. Like, Wait. You, you don't really see Zardex, so it's not like one and one that you think about. Yeah, that's about. actually. Wait. Like, it's a is he scalling or oh, toxic? So he's just trying to like switch around and let this cure and die from poison. It's all about Zard Y. Maybe his Zard is a bulky set because his team is so fat orientated. I, if that is cool. Oh, he played the diffusion bolt. I don't think. I don't. Uh, yeah, I think nice. he would go for ice beam there. Because mm -hmm. he was gonna kill anyway. So I think he just decided that he wants to sack the landers. Like he had to pick a Flora. Yeah, and Padlop said Kyurem eats the team alive. Like obvious statements. Like, I'm not Eric. sure if the Zard was not max speed. Like, why would he switch out otherwise? Does I he not have Dragon know. Claw? Oh, Mag Magnus is gonna be streaming the... Rip my views. The, um... Smokter series. I don't think they started yet, Steve Angelo. Yeah, they didn't. Man, this sucks if you missed the third game. What does it go into now? Scarf Chomp? Yeah. Mm, probably. Okay. Yeah, because. But 
Does Dragon Claw even kill this? Because they're on like max HP on I will call. No, Dragon Claw definitely doesn't kill. He would have to click outrage, I think. But yeah, then yeah, but like action. guarding Garchomp is like kind of bad for him because yeah, he has like pivots around Garchomp. Uh, Dragon Claw does 44 to 51. Yeah, Dragon Claw does nothing. Does chip damage. Curem is on speed and dies if he connects or if he has superpower or something. Okay. Um. Wait, we did, we did see it's life up QM, so he obviously. Yeah, he would die to Dragon Claw, yeah. he's life up. I, I can't assault vest. Hmm. I, I have to pay more attention to these little things, but yeah, when I'm tired, this shit happens. So, like, life orb. Uh, Dragon Claw does 53 to 62 to life orb. Damn, Gushum is weak. Yeah, Dragon Claw is I weak. I mean, he has, he has Stone Edge, but this is. But Stone Edge, like, Toxapex. I mean, hmm. Toxapex is low. How low is it? 12%. So it's at 30 something after Rock. Yeah. Because region is in Cal. Oh, Steve Angelo started versus Porsche. Damn. No. Finish outrage? Yeah, Outrage was the play. So, Gunija can water shuriken? Or, um. Yeah, I think you have to water shuriken and get enough hits. Yup. Real man. Uh, yeah, no, I was about to say, but he's locked into Outrage, so never mind. I might ask up. Uh, oh, wait. Scarf Go Ninja. Scarf Ash? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait. What oh. the fuck? Scarf Torrent? Scarf. What? What is this? It's not Scarf Protean. Or is it? It's is Scarf this, this Torrent. Is, it's what? not Ash, it's Torrent. It's not Ash because it's Scarf Torrent. Oh he my. said. What the this guy's what mean. The what the hell? He can afford to lose a best of three, so he's like, let me bring this shit. <laughs> what does this accomplish? Yeah, I. But actually, what does Scarf Torrent do? I forgot to change it. Oh my lord. Oh! <laughs> I thought he's memeing or some shit. I forgot to. So it, it was gonna be Ash, but I forgot. See? So yeah, it's just gonna click Fusion Bolt, pick off the Toxapex. Yeah, we do see the... The Porsche it's game is going on, man. I don't wanna miss any turns. Where is Chump anyways after seeing U-turn? Because it should be U-turn Ashgren. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there was no Brodin. Like, Torn is not a thing that you can predict around. I don't think that's how it works. That boy dipped. Um. No, I'm here. Oh, I thought someone else joined and left. No, no, no. It's not Scarf because it wasn't Protein. Yeah, so Steve Angelo This is the just, ultimate bluff. Steve Angelo just got the lead wrong in the other game, so we will be got... Man, I wanna record both games, this sucks. I mean, Tornadoes kinda wins, right? If it hits Hurricane. Yeah, I was about to say, does it, doesn't he just lose to Torn? Yeah, he has I mean, to hit Hurricanes on the... Can go, now we can go Mega Season and threaten with Bullet Punch, but... Oh yeah, Volcarona is still kept in check by Scarf Gwen if it gets one crew dance. Yeah. Yeah, this man is one... You think he's gonna U-turn here? Kind of 50-50? I mean, he should... Because it's, it's oh, I mean, he should just bullet punch. He's just gonna bullet punch. He's gonna play it safe. Yeah, because it's too much of a of a threat. Yeah, he can't afford to play it safe. I was about to say, despite being three and two, despite being in the lead, tornadoes, it's too much of a threat. Man, that taking really long. Porsche just made his first play after two minutes. Please take longer, dude. I don't want to miss anything. <laughs> Why did the Lottie force a Tyranitar out? Finishing it on the chair. Nice play. <laughs> yup. 
Porsche scouted for hidden power fighting, that boy's wild. Actually, it was a nice play, but... <laughs> Flaming nothing Demon nothing scouting for Trick me. Flame Orb in the other game. <laughs> They're already trolling. Staying in, predicting the U-turn was a nice play, but nothing... I mean, what, what, the, what was the Greninja gonna do? I mean, if it's HP fire, it's yeah. not gonna kill because it's not Brody. <laughs> I guess the I guess the, like the, the was, only chance here is dodging an an I think Yudan was fine there. Yeah, um, like set up on the dodge is the only play, right? Or like, oh, does he have rock slide? Um, or what? Does Tangrove has? I don't think it has. has it has slide? like knockoff. Um, of quick HP eyes, Leaf Storm. I think. Then it's then it's just gonna die. I'm pretty sure, even if. Even if it's AV, or maybe no, I don't know the calc. But oh, he um, the the Tangles might live one. I will calc this real quick if I will be able to. Yeah, I wouldn't be surprised if he actually leaves her. Hurricane does a uh, seventy-five to eighty-eight. Uh, yeah, he, he, he needs should he should live max. one unless it gets a high roll. Yeah, a max roll. That's what I meant. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, like since I'm not the black and white, um, black and white pro, I will just let Porsche re-narrate re -narrate his black and white game. Hey, um, no, it's another 50-50. Yeah, like I think this actually, time actually, I just bullet punch again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was about to say it's not it's not that much of a 50-50. Bullet punch is the play in my opinion. Like because Greninja is pretty low. He might predict the back. user in one and. Greninja might... Yeah. Wait, how much did the first bullet punch do? Did like 21 or something? Am I lagging so much? Bullet punch? I assume this two KOs easily. Like, yeah, 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 I was okay. about to say. So... Pocket is my, my actual win He is. should win this now. Uh, bullet punch plus Damn. any hit from Tangros should kill. Yeah, I think staying in with Mega Caesar predicting the Greninja to go for U turn won in the game. No, no, wait. Bullet punch plus the live or recall should kill the turn, right? Yeah. Staying in with Caesar before won in the game, I think. Staying in on wait. what? On the Greninja, the one for U turn. Oh, he just switched out so he takes more life up recoil? And that um, this way, bullet punch kills guaranteed. Yeah. Mhm. Mm <laughs> he should have won two and oh. I mean, yeah. That's what they, what I said in the chat. There was an awesome, awesome play in game. I mean, it was a cool game, and yeah, we will record game three too. And um, what else? What I was trying to say. Yeah, I will uh, ask Porsche to. Um, Make a guest narration for his uh, smoke too serious, cause I don't know black and white that well anyway, and so it's gonna be better for all of us. <laughs> I don't have to struggle to figure out black and white sets, and he can explain you what he was thinking. Uh, I might record the next game live between Porsche and Steve Angelo. It's definitely an option. But the problem is that Porsche has to study, um, he told me he has to study so he can't make the guest narration today, that sucks. Hmm. Yeah, I'll pause it and we'll be right back with game 3. Whew. 93 minutes already, uh, yeah. Oh my. We're back with game 3 and um, Dennis had to leave call unfortunately. We see Trick Room vs. Stall, like what is this? That boy bringing the fat teams. Man, that have fun when he has a fat team. I mean, at least he's not using standard stall, so it's somewhat interesting. But yeah, the Luna Dance from Cruella here is gonna be pretty um, clutch. Because he can, like, Luna Dance back up a sweeper like um, Marowak, uh, like a Mawal if the Mawal gets like burned, like if it, the Mawal kills the Sableye but it gets burned in the process, you can 
Luna lands a bag later on and then it's gonna put in a lot of work if it has the correct set. Like... <laughs> it's gonna be tough though. Because if it takes Iron Barbs from the Feral Thorn, it might be... Um, might get into range from uh, Dark Trio if it takes like Leech Seed and Iron Barbs chip. You just, just leave him with Generate in the Sableye. Pretty sure he go for uh, Volt Switch here. I mean, he can go for Florican on the Protect on the first turn and then F Volt Switch on the next turn. I would never go hard to Doggy because he, like, he needs the Doggy. Like, he cannot afford. Oh, wow, I completely forgot it's a Trick Room team. So, with Fle he flexes on him turn one, goes for Trick Room. And if he doesn't have Volt Switch, I assume he doesn't have Volt Switch because I, I was first thinking this is AV, but it's obviously Trick Room. So, like, this team has um, four Trick Room setters. I think Koopa gets Trick Room too. I know these three get Trick Room for sure. I think Koopa, sh Koopa should get Trick Room. So, the chance he's coming out here, so I would double switch into. Yeah, the Marek. The Marek is fine here. Yeah, you can go Marek and click flat. Um, did you come Nice. Oh, Mowal F. I thought you went Marek. Hmm. Yeah, so Rob, he has to win this. And then um, there will be another best of three. Kinda like Poik when Poik won a uh, old T. Whereas Eternal, he also had to win two best of threes. I think it's Fire Fang. Is it Fire Fang? Or it just goes for SD. So yeah, this is what I'm talking about. Moa is getting weak now from Lead Sheet. Oh my lord, goodbye. But now he's in range from Dougie, that's the problem. That's the problem. Like he can't healing wish a uh, Luna dance the Moa back now. Because the Dougie's focus sash, yeah. Oh wait, he went for substitute. Wait, what? Am I okay in the head? I think he made a misplay there. He probably thought he breaked the sucker punch and thought the trick room was already over. He didn't he forgot that the mower is faster. I clicked knock oh actually this is kinda Ah I would have clicked knocked off again. No, Cause like he had to, he had to like, make, cause now he gets has enough health to make another substitute. So I, I knew he would make some sort of play that wasn't attacking. Damn. Ah, uh, I mean it's kind of it was a 50-50, yeah, but that hurts, man. He would have just, I think he would have just won there if he got, if he went for knockoff again. But I mean at least he got rid of the slow bro and he weakened the die, he broke the sash, but he has rocks on his side now. And he can't get rid of the rocks, which is going to be annoying for Marowak. Yeah. So I assume we're going to see the Trick Room again, or the switch into Marowak. Wait, Psychic? I mean, I, I would have predicted the, the Chansey, but Sable is another nice play by finding True Love because it covers the Marowak. Like, say, I can take a hit from Merrick and knock it off, and then it's basically useless. So, we see it's um, Zemo of Magirna, it doesn't lose an item. Um. Oh, it's, so it's probably Bolt Beam, but. Is that Z Focus Blast? It is Focus Blast, Z Focus Blast, goodbye! I wasn't sure if he was that sad. Could have also been Calm Mind in the last slot, or. Um. Yeah, so it's probably Ice Beam, T-Bolt, Focus Blast, Trick Room. I was thinking... Hmm. Yeah, I've seen that comment said in OEPL lately. Yeah, Gemma has used this in her life too. Man, Gemma's such a good mon, dude. But I'm not really sure if I would've made that play, cause... Chansey should have been able to tank that. I think I would have gone Chansey. I mean, I can calc real quick. Oh, your utility, most Chanseys don't run. Uh, Spidef on stall, I don't think. 
So I will call it uh, Magina All Out Pummeling. Oh, your offensive trick room. Focus Blast, Z move. Um, that's 41 to 48 percent. So yeah, I probably would have gone Chansey. Chansey, that's in the Merrick. But he still has some ways around the Merrick, and Merrick has to tag rocks. So I don't think I would have sacked the Pharaoh Thorn, but it's always easy to say when you're just watching. Am I missing something here? Let me think. Because I actually can't think clear at all anymore because it's like, like... I'm super tired. Let me see. So yeah, yeah, he went, he went into a um, Magiona on the Sableye. And then he switched into Pharaohs on instead of Chansey, which is weird. The Magiona obviously ate up the Earthquake and he's like kind of surprised. But yeah, yeah, it's obviously max HP. I was about to say that. Because on Trick Room you can afford to run max HP. Because he doesn't want to go Chansey. What? Doesn't Chansey outspeed this? Data chance because it should be minus speed nature, right? If it's a trick on gene. Okay, so it's going for the freeze. I mean, Clefable. Fable. Yeah, this is a this is um. I guess it's a fine play. Yeah. Because he knows it's probably a bolt beam focus blast. So if he was flash can, that would have been pretty bad for finding true love. But yeah, he has to switch out basically. Try to go for the freeze once and. The Sable is pretty obvious here, yes, so if he specs Hooper, I can see a double into specs Hooper. I goes back into Magiona. Knows that the Sable I can't kill it with knockoff. But yeah, it's basically just absolutely nothing, so I don't know why he hasn't brought the Chansey earlier on the Magiona. Jonah can live another rock switching at least, which is cool. Oh, he toxic breathing the switch. But Rob is like, I just want to get some chip. That actually did a good chunk. Now he's gonna switch out breaking the seismic toss in the Hooper. So yeah, he toxic breathing the Hooper he turned before. And he dodges the toxic there. So it's life or Hooper. Trick room three attacks, I assume. I don't think it's nasty plot. Psyshock bounced off, man. Chansey just walls everything. Besides Merrick, but Merrick has to take rocks when it comes in. Like, Flavis or Merrick will tweet kill the Chansey, but... Yeah. He doesn't just want to go hard Merrick on a potential toxic, even though the Chansey is forced to softball here, so... Uh, Merrick might be, in, might be the play here. Well, I, w I mean, he wasn't forced to softball, but I think I would have softballed it there. I mean, you always risk the crit there if you not don't softball. But if the Chansey stays in the Toxic Merrick, it's gonna die to Flabbits, I assume. The Merrick has Rocket on Trick Room Team, so it doesn't take Recoil. Yeah, yeah, he just toxic this, but goodbye. But that lives? That has to be a roll or something. Hmm. Damn, this video is already, already 50 minutes. I might have to... Yeah, I don't know what softballing did there, but... I guess he didn't have a play, because... Seismic Toss doesn't work, Toxic, he's already Toxic, and... Was the last move Rocks on Chansey? No, he, he set up Rocks with a Duggy, so I don't know if the last move was like Wish or Heal Bell. Usually the Heal Bell is on the Clefable on stall teams when it's paired um, Clefable plus Chansey. But I saw in Aura sometimes Coleman Clefable plus um, Heal Bell on Chansey. 
but yeah, uh, I've gone away from stall a bit. I don't really use it anymore. Just, uh, just when I like, f when I'm frustrated on the suspect ladder. I want to get easy wins <laughs> sometimes. But yeah. The thing is if he switch the Merrick out, he's really low, because he has to take another round of rocks. I mean, he's obviously just gonna wish protect spam here, try to... Like, he doesn't lose anything from clicking wish, so I kinda agree with switching out. But we will see... Hmm. Rob definitely has the tools to win this. He can Luna Dance into Majern... Well, he goes hard Majern up in the... Sableye, what a god. Um... The thing is, can he even touch this? Like, <laughs> I think is his best move to hit this. I don't think he has Flurrican. Yeah, I don't think he has Flurrican, so this... I think this might... Yeah, this dies to, like... If it doesn't die to Knock Off, it would die to Will-O-Wisp. Like, Fighting True Love can Kalk here. It's max HP. So Knock Off might not kill. Um... Just goes for protect scouting for potential floor cam, but yeah, we already know it doesn't have it. I mean, it doesn't. It's not confirmed, but just the way the magician has been played. And there's a freeze. I mean, he was using stall. He was on the defense. It was about to happen. Damn it! They deserved. He said I had this. I don't know if he had it. And Rob said I'm pretty sure I had this. Yeah, I think it was a little in Rob's favor. But yeah, if, if Rob wins, I guess I'll make another best of... Another video for the second best of three. Because this is already 52 minutes. And it's gonna take long enough to upload. As Clefable drops. And yeah, Sable, I can win this game at this point. Just forfeits and but with she game I wins the first best of three and it's basically even now because he was in losers bracket and his opponent was in winners bracket and yeah now that's gonna be another best of three I don't know if they're gonna play it now or another time I think they're gonna play it now we will see and I'll be right back with a different video uh, maybe not be right back maybe I'll upload it a few hours or one day after. Thank you guys for watching. Bit sad that Dennis couldn't join us, but he doesn't like stall, so he wouldn't have been happy to watch this game with me, so it's fine. Um, hopefully we'll be back for the next game, we'll see. And Darkwitch signing out. Peace.